Season's greetings, everyone. I can't tell you, man, it's a great, great day. as every day. But I have some special, someone special here, man. A good friend of mine from New York City. And we've done a lot of work, but he's, he called me up saying, man, I'm coming in town. I got to see you. Stop by the club and bless A Bay Park. So our good friend, actor Keen Holiday, and of course I have my brother, Ronald Arsenault. I wanted him to sit in and share some words of inspiration. First, I'm going to start off with Keen. Keen, man, thank you for having He's thinking, thinking uh, I just want to by. let everybody know in America that even though a lot of people here are not mashed up, I'm from New York, I'm from Dallas, Dallas, Texas, Frisco, Texas, and we mask up, okay? It ain't about politics, it's about the fact that you got to take care of yourself and so others. So I've been a lot of places, so I am masked up and I'm going to come out of it now so y'all can see me. How y'all doing? Let me tell you something. This is a family reunion. This is this man here. It's Mr. Chris Arsenal. Is the one that introduced me to the game of golf and made me see how serene and beautiful it is out on the golf course. How it's another world, another environment, and that I have been so blessed by that. I have always reached out to Chris to try to use my skills and, and my abilities to help him move forward with his project. So we're here now. Chris is now the top, the pro golf uh, instructor here at this municipal golf course that has tremendous history in Lafayette, Louisiana. So that is where I'm at today, and it's been really cool. I'm looking forward to having a wonderful, wonderful relationship with Chris and this golf course in the near future. Braden, if you're watching, that's my grandson. Braden, if you're watching, it's really going to be a nice place to come and play. So I want to share also, Ronald, share some uh, words of wisdom. I mean, you know, I can't tell you how much it means, man, having my brother a part of this because this is something that's memorable for me. So everybody that's listening, you know my brother's uh, means everything. I know me, with me returning home, having my mom, you know, seeing my mom at her age, and then my family, and then also having my son just here, and then my brother, man, I, I can't tell you, all my family and friends that supported me, this little kid chasing this little white golf ball, what a dream. Right here from Persian Street, and uh, right at Louisiana, Louisiana Avenue, man, they got a chance to travel the country, New York City, and you name it, I've done it. So, it's exciting, man, to be home. Ronald, please share something, man, word of, of uh, inspiration. Hey, I don't care if it's scripture, whatever it is, share what's just, in your heart. Just a blessing to see how your dream just come to pass. You know, I remember as a kid, when we were kids, when we first came here, you know, just, we was always passionate about the game of golf. Today, to see, you know, we were looking outside that fence, and now you're sitting behind the desk that you can hear me in. Yeah. So that's a blessing. Which scripture you would uh, share? I mean, you guys don't know. I told him he's uh, he's Junior T.D. Jakes. Uh, I tease him all the time, Keen, about this. So share, share a scripture, man, that you feel that somebody could go. I know you're, you're in life, highlight something that somebody can use. Some scripture I live by that he say that never leave us nor forsake us. And that's something that I live by. I embed it in my heart. So, so Keen, as another brother, I mean, we've done a lot of work to help. And we'll be sh talking soon about the arts program. You know, everybody knows I have the STEAM Academy in New York with my uh, my good friend Anissa Moore, our executive director. Mm -hmm. And the STEAM stands for Science, Technology, Engineer, Arts, Math, and Sports. Arts is where we're going to speak with Keen. Keen and, have, and I have done a lot of work together, but it's exciting to come back to Louisiana and use this as a as a bridge to branch it anywhere, where you, where, you know, where anywhere it can go and create an opportunities for the next generation. So Keen, share a little bit about Multimedia Theater and well, some of your work. Uh, I am. On two occasions, depending on where I was living, my my mentor was a man by the name of Van Tile Moto Chico Whitfield, and so I carry Moto wherever I go because Moto embraced my life and enhanced my life in theater in Washington D.C. Moto was a, a great director a scenic designer. He was a man of all things in theater. And, um, you know, so I have tried to embrace that spirit in wherever I go. So I'm now looking at, I come to visit Chris here in Lafayette, Louisiana, which I had never 
I've ever been here before. And the reception has been so beautiful, so excited, so elevated that I have decided that I would love to establish some type of uh, theatrical company here in, in uh, Lafayette because yeah. I know there's a lot of talented people here and a lot of beautiful music here. So we're going to see what we can do to move along on that direction as well as bringing the community in to embrace golf at this magnificent municipal uh, course. So that, that's about the, the size of it at this time. Chris, I just thank you for the invitation and for the stimulation. Chris sent me a blurb on Facebook that said, here I am as the head of the golf course, the head tour pro at, the, at this uh, municipal golf course here in uh, Lafayette. And I said, man, I gotta go down there and get with my brother so we can keep, continue doing some of the things that we started in New York City on Long Island. So again, guys, you see, it all started with golf. Don't ever judge a book by its cover. I've been able to meet some of the some amazing people from around the country. I don't get into all that. You can check out the uh, Google me. You can see the work I've done. I've done a lot of work. Uh, I'm blessed to be able to uh, create opportunities for the next generations. So I'm happy to uh, collaborate with other organizations as well. It's a it's a great blessing. So again, golf is just a tool. It's actually been my ministry, if I can put it in, in words, to help others. So again, golf saved my life. When drugs and crack cocaine was hitting the streets, it saved my, my life, it became a safe haven. So again, I'm playing it forward on another level because I'm finally in position now to, to do something even greater. So again, thank you, Ronald, thank you, Keen, and everybody that's listening, thank you guys, happy holidays, you guys thank be you, safe. Chris, I appreciate you guys. Thank you. And thank you, Lord, for my safe passage on these highways. Thank you so much for stepping in and being with me during this journey. You know, the Lord says in Jeremiah 33 and 3, Call unto me, cry out unto me, and I shall answer thee, and I will show thee great and mighty things that you know not of. Amen. Amen. So guys, happy holidays. Y'all be safe. Anything you want to see? Good. So again, Happy I know I hit my brother. Uh, I hit my brother at the last minute. So again, I hit him. You know, threw, threw him in the uh, in the bride patch. So guys, thank you. Nice. Uh, happy holidays. You guys be safe. Bless. And we'll see you again real soon.